What's up YouTube? This is here and today we are back for another Call of Duty Advanced Warfare gameplay video. But as you can see, I'm using something a bit different which I haven't exactly used before. This is the first tool, pretty cool. Um, now this is indeed, if you know your Call of Duty Advanced Warfare really well, then this is indeed the KF5. Now, I uh, didn't really like this weapon at the start. Obviously, I seem to be doing well, pretty good at the moment, but um, yeah, not a big fan. Honestly, just I try to keep away from it, but I prestiged over the weekend, so I thought it would be a good opportunity just to try it out. Don't, don't punch me through the window, dude. That was just dumb. Um, thought I'd try it out, and I actually unlocked the Elite version, which I'm using at the moment, called the Spanner. And, uh, it's got, like, increased range and stuff like that. I can't remember exactly the stats off the top of my head, but it's actually really good. So, pretty much today, I've just been, uh, grinding up as you do on Advanced Warfare, just playing the games, going through the motions, all of that. And, uh, I thought, well... I've been doing alright so far, so I'll record this game, and uh, we'll see, oh, that was lucky, that that was so lucky, literally, this range is not good, so, <laughs> got him too, um, so if you can, like, tap fire it like I did there, and it only took two bursts, or one burst, depending on how you perceive it, but it put it this way, it doesn't take that long, like I'm not sure exactly the damage, but whoa, what no damn it. So many people. Um, yeah, so it really just depends how you shoot it. Like if you're accurate obviously as you saw you'll probably get the kill. Camp in a corner. So yeah. I've been using this a lot today. Damn it. Um, and I'm actually really enjoying it, right? But, uh, the main purpose, or uh, the main, uh, topic that I... Oh, get back! Get back, son! Uh, that I want to talk about today, so <laughs> sorry about that if that was a bit weird. Um, is actually Black Ops 3, right? So, I... Let's see, look how... Wow, that just melts. Uh, I've pre-ordered it already, and I am... So so pumped for Black Ops 3. As you can see, I don't know whether you can see properly, but uh, I've actually made a really, really nice Black Ops 3 uh, emblem, and it looks so good. It actually turned out a lot better than I thought, just as a little tribute. And um, if you haven't already noticed, there's a bit of an update, or actually a couple of updates to my channel that I'll just uh, quickly go over now. The first thing, obviously, that you saw at the start of the video, is that I have a brand new intro. Yes, I have used the same, not very, <laughs> not very good intro for the past what two years, and I was just not satisfied with it. So I thought, well, with Black Ops Three coming out in November and me being so pumped about it, pre-ordering and all that, I thought, well, what a good opportunity it would be to make a new intro. And, obviously, my favourite colour is blue, and that's usually the colour of my emblem, but I thought, well, because it's Black Ops 3, damn it, I pre fired him. Because it's Black Ops 3, why don't I just make it orange, and it actually turned out really, really well. Uh, it is a template, like, it. I still need to practice actually doing it, so I'll leave a link down in, this, uh, in the description where I got the idea from. I obviously did change a couple of things, but yeah, you can get a brief outline of where I got it from, in case you're like starting out your own YouTube, and you want to uh, make your own. So yeah, that was an uh, interesting one. God, that guy's fast. Oh, no! No! See, this is why I hate the KF5 sometimes. It just doesn't kill quick enough. It's got an okay fire rate, but the damage is just not up there compared to the ASM one. 
because that has 12, this has 7. But anyway, enough about my rambling. Uh, the next topic, or the next thing to my channel, is actually I have a brand new uh, layout to my uh, actual videos, as you can see. And uh, I want to know whether you guys actually like it or not. So leave a comment down the bottom and tell me whether you actually like that. Tell me any critiques because this is the first time using it. So uh, yeah, just tell me what you think. I think it turned out pretty good. So uh, yeah, just leave a comment just down below and tell me what you think. That guy's okay. <laughs> uh, and finally, the last topic. Uh, I actually have. I have actually made myself a Twitter account for my channel, so uh, it is the same as my channel here, OMG It's Bibu Thidding, that is on Twitter. You can also see it up at the top left of the screen, if you forget. And it will always be up there, so just keep your eyes open and watch. So yeah, go have a look at that. I don't do too many updates, but it's always good just to see when I've got Ah, I didn't even pick it up! Damn it! Um, yeah, just to see when I have new videos up and all of that, because what's the point of not knowing when somebody's going to upload a video if you're following them? And it's, it's just a lot easier. Just go, go sub to my channel or whatever it is. So yeah, that was a pretty good game. I actually enjoyed that. Fairly quick. Um, so yeah, hope you guys enjoyed, remember to leave a like if you liked it, and uh, comment on two things, number one, obviously what I've told you about in the video, and whether you are, you are pumped for Black Ops 3. Yes, I'll leave you on that, see you next time, PEACE!